interesting little community. Wolves. I got goosebumps. I do. I'm just excited to see how this all comes to an end. Because this thing, it can't end well. Like, I'm sure it could have an overall happy ending, but there's definitely got to be something that happens. Hey, I'm going to go see what Joanne is doing. Joan. <laughs> go for it. That is Joan. I have to bring back the telescope to Stanley and Arthur. Went to town for weekly supplies. Some pancakes left in the kitchen? <laughs> back soon. Yeah, just stick that telescope in your back pocket, you know, as one does. Daniel, you copy? Yes, I read you. Ten four. I have a pancake alert in the kitchen. Repeat. Pancake alert. Oh man. Sorry. I was gonna eat with Joanne. Over and out. Ten four. No flying pancakes today. Let me just oh Jesus. Got my money back. Yeah, we got 1400 Can't use this cash. <clears throat> Can't use this cash in Mexico. Where am I going to exchange it? Oh, that's a good point. He was saving up all that money so he could get to Mexico. Oh, man. We should have given it to him then. Pretty useless with the crazy moonlight we had, but it scares the coyotes away. And I'll be able to look at the stars in a new way. Thanks, Karen. Karen hooked us up with some cool camping gear. Reading Brody's writing always makes me feel like he's right here with me, like I can still hear his voice. Daniel's just not into drawing anymore. It's okay, he has a superpower. Grandparents' letter. Cassidy's letter. Karen hooked us up with some cool camping gear. Yep, saw that. Sorry, hippies, we still gotta have our candy. Relics from another life. Joan makes the best curries ever. Okay, I think I've looked at everything else. Still haven't checked it yet. Maybe now is the right time? Yeah, no shit. Daniel's inventory. Hot dog man. Magic scroll. See, Mars is still around. Chris's letter. Snowman toy. Spirit cape. Journal. The map. One, two, three, four. No. It's like one. No, one, two. Oh, no. One, two, three. Four, five. Thus far. It's nice to play games with Daniel again. <laughs> Karen likes to join us too. Okay. Nice mess. <laughs> Daniel will never change. Uh. Still can't believe she's kept it. We gotta go out stickers. We could also try to be self sufficient when we're in Mexico. Stickers? Like for my bag? Yeah. She wolf. Interesting. But I can't actually use you son of a bitch. I always find the shit that I can't actually use. <laughs> Crops. Excuse me, water boy. Did you remember to feed the crops? I never forget. Ask mom. But no way I could grow 
know stuff like she can. Or maybe in Metzger. <laughs> oh, yeah. We can grow a lot of stuff there. Okay. David. David. Yeah, this, this is something. I'm looking at this place. This is something I've been spoiled about. I see that Karen really wanted to get away from it all. If this is the David I'm thinking <laughs> Literally. of. Literally. David always wants to help, but he's tough to figure out. Ah, uh, we don't get to meet him just yet. Mm-hmm. Yeah, the, this, this specific <laughs> David, I know he's in the game. Arthur and Stanley probably want their telescope back. I hope the UFOs are listening. Hmm. Stanley and Arthur's house. Well, out of there, Morning, fellas. Morning, Sean. Morning, guys. Hey, what's up? Morning, Sean. How you doing? Join us. Have a seat. Okay, I will have a seat. Hey, just in time for our special desert brew. Oh, hell yeah. And dust free. Thanks. So much. Sean, it's too early to be so awake. <laughs> no kidding. Hey, how was your sleepover in the canyon? <sighs> Amazing. We watched the sunrise. Daniel loved it too. That's my favorite view out here. It's like ancient times, but it never gets old. Unlike us, darling. <laughs> that canyon will be here long after we're gone. Hope you looked up. We did. Thanks for hooking us up. <laughs> Anytime. Even my daughter Becky loves to stargaze when she visits us. That's the only way to get Arthur to camp now. <laughs> Becky is the real astronomer in the family. Hell yeah, Wonder Becky. Wonder where she got this. From her mom, probably. Hope you guys get to meet Becky. Okay. Does she come visiting often? Not as much as I'd want. Aww. Can't really blame her. But you know, well, some parts of the year, this place is full of friends and family. Christmas, for example. So, don't you ever get bored? Being out here is a big change. We do sometimes. We're in a desert. <laughs> I miss the parks, cafes. Shopping, but this place is something else. Okay, and then. we feel safe out here. Fair enough. If you could have seen me as a family man a few years ago, I had everything but nothing. Now I have nothing but everything. But everything. Poetic. Thanks to this one. <sighs> How sweet. After we got together, we both had serious breakdowns. Then we got the hell out of the Bay Area. For the better. I hear that. I'm just so fucking tired of running. I hope me and Daniel find our own away. You will. People come here to reset their life. Become the person they want to be. Or used to be. You're smart. You'll figure out your next direction. Right, Gramps? Speak for yourself, Grandpa. <laughs> My body might be 59, but I'm 25. <laughs> uh-huh. I'll remember that on the next hike. <laughs> I'm gonna see what Daniel's up to. Thanks for the desert, Brew. I like him. These two remind me of Claire and Steven. In a weird, hippie version. Huh. You think they picked this up at the gas station? I hope not. It's too cute. <laughs> Wonder where he's at now. Hmm. He could write her whole story. That would be neat, wouldn't it? Nice. <laughs> now that's some real patriots. Hell yeah. Hey, Sean. What were you doing at Arthur and Stanley's place? You're a little too young to be stalking me, dude. Day. 
kind of weird. There are a couple. You know, it's actually normal for people in love to kiss, right? I know. I just mean, they're really cute together. I hope somebody cares about me like that when I get old. Same. Hey, artist, it's come been a while since we last heard about we'll Donnie. Wild sculpture. Do you think he'll be back from Hold rehab up. someday? I'll be over in a minute. I didn't know you ever left. Look at that. Gosh. I thought there was only vultures in the desert. That's what I love about you. Life is a journey. Better stay home. Wish I could be as cool and as wise as these guys when I get older. Again. I didn't come out to the desert to be awake at 5 a.m. Arthur and Stanley cannot wait for the 4th of July. Understandable. <sighs> Me neither. Honestly, fireworks out in this kind of area? There's really not many obstructions. You could just see that see that shit clear as day. What if the police find out what can do? That's just too sad, honey. No matter what happened be Hey. Your Captain Spirit drawing was awesome. <laughs> Thanks. Uh, you get it awesome because it was the Yep. Let's make it happen. Yeah. Instead of snowmen, we can make sand castles. Definitely. <laughs> I'm just yes, ignoring you. You think you can ignore me? Yes. Yeah, see, they said his you Captain Spirit thing was awesome because it was the because be the episode was called the Awesome Adventures Let's of Captain do. Spirit. Just saying. Mm -hmm. Don't think I don't notice. I notice. This is such a weird fucking place. But like in a good way. But that's what I bet hippie started this place. Welcome to away. Leave the past I'm today. I'm starting to see where I stay. The founding sisters. Established in 1975. Away, Arizona. Population? Question mark? I'm not done exploring though. Sit? No, we do not sit. Okay, that's Joanne. Sand drawing. I wish Daniel wasn't the only kid in town. Yeah, it's gonna be rough. But at least he's found people he can get along with, right? Like, they may not be able to be BFFs or anything, but, you know. This part of town is dead this time of year. Okay, I guess I won't I go there stay then. around here. Fine. Be that way. Sculpture. We helped Joanne set up this giant vacuum with binoculars, <laughs> as David calls it. Love the energy out here, with everyone building stuff as they please. The movie theater. Dude, remember when you totally fell asleep during that Bollywood flick? <laughs> because it was so lame after those cool cartoons. <laughs> Whatever. You missed Priya and Stanley teaching me how to dance. No, I didn't. You can't dance, dude. <laughs> I could totally dance. Fuck you. Don't you even worry about it. This place is the ultimate playground for Daniel. <laughs> Joanne can throw a total rager out here, but without asshole neighbors. I mean, that sounds wonderful. Board game, just call it chess. It's chess board. Karen and Joanne spend evenings playing and chatting. <laughs> kind of like me and Lila. Aww. Back in the day. Oh, the way his voice trailed off there. Joanne says she needs all this junk to grow inspiration from. There's power cuts all the time here, but no one's really bothered by it. I mean, yeah, you kind of have to come to accept it if you live all the way the fuck out here. 
I love how they recycle everything into art, construction, or agriculture here. Joanne picks up all kinds of scraps from the desert. Like a fucking car? She even found a boat once. Jesus. Apparently. Wow. How the hell does Joanne drag entire cars and boats back? Too bad there's nobody my age here. <laughs> but this is where people come to get old. I love how they recycle everything into art. Yeah, we saw this one. Construction or agriculture here. What's up, Joanne? See for yourself. Man, check this out. Okay, Daniel, let's take a little break. Got it. Was that a car hood? That child is something else. Something special. Something special. Yeah. There we go. I knew it was gonna be something along those lines. Don't worry. Mm, yeah, I bet. <laughs> I bet you have your own talent, Sean. I'm dead serious. It's nothing special compared to what he has. Well, what he has is some next level sci fi shit, Sean. <laughs> you can't compare yourself to him. None of us can. But what you have is a precious gift that will guide you through this cosmogonic mess if you let it. Did you always want to be an artist? <laughs> Good grief, no. <laughs> I tried very hard not to be one. Till I realized it was useless. Yeah. No Listen, use in fighting your passion. You want to be an artist? You will be. <laughs> it's not always easy. But in the end, it's pretty fucking cool. <laughs> Speaking of, do you mind giving me a hand here? Oh. Uh Sure. I don't know if I can. Yes, you can. I just need your input. Okay? Radio. Okay. Sure. Why not? Ah, there you go. Now, go stand over there. Okay. Daniel, you ready to start again? Oh, yes. Hold on. Hey, look, it's BB-8. <laughs> So, for my next turn, I'd love to see if you can connect these three pieces. I've made a model of what I have in mind here, but go ahead and be the artist. And we don't need a crane to lift this stuff. <laughs> Daniel can snap these together like block toys. Hell yeah. Let's do this. We need the ball. Maybe that's supposed to represent the earth. Or a ball. So I can do it in whatever order I want. Ready, Sean? Interesting. Um, I don't know, should we do it in a different order or should we do it out of order? I don't know. Don't think too much, Sean. First thought, best thought. Okay, Daniel. Can you slam dunk the earth ball onto the base? Watch this layup. You should totally do like the model, but with the spider on top. Also, oh, that's what I was thinking.
Hmm. Now, let's move Mr. Pancake's head onto the pedestal. Sweet. See where you're going with this? Clever. Uh, where is he going? Now, let's throw on that spider. See, shot. It's hair. Hey, can you? Turn that earth ball around a little bit. Totally. <laughs> mhm. Mm uh, to do turn the head left. Just like half a turn. Check it out. <laughs> no, not the ball. The head. <laughs> okay. How about turning that pancake head? There he goes. <laughs> and then turn. Yo, can you turn that that uh, spider thingy around? You got it. One more. I want the high one above his head. Maybe give that spider another twist? Watch this. Yeah. Yeah. I feel like we're almost done. Well, I think this is it. Looks good to me. Only if the muse approves. Oh, yeah. It's super cool. Thanks for listening to me, Sean. It's exactly what I wanted. <laughs> you did a great job, Inanna. Well, Sean, Daniel, I think art might be in your family DNA. <laughs> There's no escape. I think we're done for the day. Hell Thank yeah. you so much for your help. Okay. That was fun. Joanne is so chill about her art. That's what makes her talented. I bet you would like Minecraft. <laughs> it, it's kind of like this. Yeah, I've read about it. It's a video game, right? Yes. And you can build whatever you want in it. Ooh, you have to show me then. Precarious patriot. Shrouded in dust. That's cool, Joanne trusted me to help build her sculpture. Related politics. Yeah, you hate it. All the way down. Up. You okay, Joanne? Yeah, as fine as frogs here, sweetie. I, I like to take a good look at a piece after I'm done working on it. Uh, it helps me connect with it. Cool. I well, do like the fact that it's kind of looking out. Thanks for letting me be a part of it. Oh, thank you, Sean. See you around, hon. Wait for Karen to come back. Is David back? Because I've, I've been really looking forward to seeing David. Swap box. It's so cool that people want to give a second life to their stuff. Interesting. Oh. 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 Oh.